Yo, what goes everybody? Back at get with another live stream for you guys. So in this one, I'm going to be continuing playing Telltale's The Walking Dead, A New Frontier. A New Frontier. So uh, yeah, this is the part where I left off the last time, and uh, yeah, let's get into this. And my bad for uh, in regards to like you know the camera, I had to fix it up real quick so that you guys can you know see properly. And, uh, yeah, without further ado, let's get into this, uh, live stream. What the what fuck do you fuck think you're doing, doing with our gas? gas? Go, on, Go on, speak, speak up. up! This is the guy I do not like. Well, it's not well, like it's I saw like your name on it. Don't fucking test me, boy. You ain't the loner type. I can tell. I know you got people. They're out scouting around. But they'll be back soon. They're not gonna be too happy if they see you pointing a piece at me. Yeah, probably not. Then again, maybe they're already here. Waiting to make an ambush. Fan out, look for the others. Lonnie, you're with me. You assholes in there! I got your boy! You don't want him getting shot, you best come out there careful with your hands up! Go on, you first. You get ambushed by your own people, that shit's gonna make my day. Open it real slowly. Looks like you and your friends had a real feast, huh? You can't just take what you like. I ate all those. Yeah, me. You? By yourself? Nah. Yeah, what can I say? I fucking love pudding. You got a real smart mouth. You fucking watch what you say. Yeah, this guy, I'm Look, telling I, you, this I, clown! I all right. You're starving. Who the fuck is it? At the end of your rope, thought you hit pay dirt. Honest mistake. But I got this sneaky fucking feeling <clears throat> that you're full of shit. I ain't gonna let it be like the last time some assholes rolled on us. Keep an eye on this dickhead. I wanna grab some cuffs. You got it. Just chill, okay? No need to make this any harder. Look, just, just let me go, okay? Please. Look, man. This doesn't have to go. What the fuck was that noise? What you got hiding under there, boy? If you know something, you better spill it. Fuck! Get the fuck in here! <laughs> Got you, <now>, Dick! <laughs> Holy shit! Boom! That's what you get for being a dumbass. You have to pay for what you done here. Wait, 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 wait! Don't. Well, that kind of sucked. <laughs> Yeah, if you guys are enjoying, uh, yeah. If you guys want something to say, please say it down in the, the, the <gasps> chat below. Hey, my family, where are they? What did you do with my family? Fucking asshole. Just do us both a favor and pretend you're still asleep. I wouldn't start talking if I were you. You're lucky we do things a certain way. I'm already tempted to put a bullet in your brain for what you did to Lonnie back there. If we start talking, I'm gonna get angry. There's gotta be a way we can work all this out. 
You know, make a deal or something. It ain't my call, all right? You best be glad it ain't. Please, just stop, all right? You don't want me riled up, kid. Not another word, or God help me, I'll put you to sleep myself. We still got a haul ahead of us, and I'm not about to listen to you. What the heck? Stop! Stop! Oh, shit! No, no, no! Epic fail! Just keep looking forward. Look, I'm already having a bad fucking day here. This is not what it looks like. What it looks like is you shot an unarmed guy in the back. Or is that not what I saw? Okay, now don't do anything stupid. Cause I'll shoot a lot quicker than you did. You're a kid. Well, wait, did you do that? With the tree? I was trying to stop the truck. Oh, shit. Yeah. You stopped it all right. We fell slower than I thought it would. Put your hands up. And close your eyes. Look, I'm the victim here. We're all victims. Oh, so it's okay for you to rob me? This is payment for saving you. Hey, that's for my niece. She loves chocolate more than anything. I promised it to her. Please. Keep your eyes closed and count to a hundred before you go. Wait, just... My family. I need to get back to them. We were attacked and I don't... Look, I just need to know where I am. We were driving down the 522 and that's when we found the junkyard. They're still there. I need to get back to them. I know where that is. You said you were driving? In our van, yeah. I'll take you to the junkyard if you let me have your van. I get you there in one piece, then I drive away. Yeah, absolutely. You got a deal. Good. Let's go. This really necessary? I don't know you, I don't trust you, and I'm not taking any chances. So it's safer for both of us if you're tied up. Look, I get it. You're being cautious. Glad we understand each other. The name's Javier, by the way. People call me Javi. Clementine. Now it's nice to meet you, Clementine. If you say so. You don't want to talk? Fine. But how about you give me that gun back so I can at least defend myself? For all I'd know, you'd turn around and use it on me. You give me a weapon, we can protect each other. 
I give you a weapon, I can't take my eyes off you. At least this way I know what I'm up against. Muertos. The herd caught up with us. Muertos. What do you call them? Walkers. Well, what do you call the ones that run? They're all fucking walkers, okay? Look, I'm just... I'm not used to being around other people. Not for a while, anyway. Yeah. Well, it shows. What? Meaning you could sure use a dust-up on those people skills. <laughs> what I don't like about this game is that some of the choices already matter. This junkyard? My brother's kids. And his wife. It's impressive. Surviving this long. Not sure how you did it. Just keeping everyone together like that. Well, I didn't do it alone. My, uh, well, uh, Kate helped. She did most of the work, actually. Sounds nice. Having a partner. It is. Well, how about you? You must have been pretty young when this shit started. I was. But some people looked out for me, too. What happened to them? Same thing that happens to everyone. Shit. We can't stay here. There's a town up ahead. We can stay there until the herd passes. Otherwise, we're walker food. Can you do that, please? We can't make a detour. I need to get to my family. And I need that van. But right now, you have to trust me. Oh, you mean the way you trust me? Don't make me regret this. Come on! When the graphics in this game look a little okay to me. There! But, uh, yeah, some of the choices don't matter. I don't like that. Get to the gate. They make the choices in season four matter, but they don't make the choices in season three matter. Go open up. Shit. Season three, that being new frontier. Hey, open yeah. up. I can't open the gate till you clear them out. Can't risk it. One of these days, those doors are going to close, and your ass will be on the other side. <laughs> yeah, and when that day comes, Trip, I promise I'll eat you first. It's Clementine, right? You staying a while this time? No. Once the walkers pass, I'm taking this guy to a junkyard off the highway. My family might be trapped there, hiding from some very bad dudes. Well, shit. I'm truly sorry to hear that. This herd rolled in pretty quick. We're hoping it's gone just as fast. So, just keep your heads down and steer clear of trouble. You got me? There's too much going on outside the walls tonight. We'll be cool. Just need a place to ride out the herd, that's all. All right. I'm gonna hold you to that. And I wouldn't recommend changing your mind if you want to hang on to all your teeth, that is. Now head on in. I got shit to do. Well, welcome to Prescott. It's a pretty cool place, actually. Built from an old airstrip, I guess. The people, on the other hand, they're not my favorite. Speaking of Prescott, we barely get anything with this community. Usually I'm in and out as quick as I can manage. 
Not exactly an option this time, though. It's just a pit stop, okay? We're gone as soon as there's a window. I hope that window comes soon. In the meantime... But then again, I do agree with the... What's... what's up? I agree with the fact that they could have done the, this community better. They're still out there. If you guys made it this long, I I'm sure you know... they'll know what to do. Hopefully. Let's go. This way. I gotta see a guy about some bullets. Jeez. I haven't been in a place like this since... Well, you know... It's just like the old days. It's a bar. Listen, <laughs> what do you mean by I gotta that? take care of something. Hang tight. Well, wait, wait. What should I do? I don't know. Why don't you make some friends? He says, oh, I haven't been in a place like this since the old days. But it's like, it looks like a bar. It looks, literally, like, look at the area. This whole area looks like a bar. So what do you mean by, oh, it, it, it looks just like I haven't been in a place like this looks since like old, days, old days. I'm like, dude, what the? It's a bar. What do you expect it was? I wonder where they found this old thing. I haven't seen one of these in years. Hmm. Out of order. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, you again. <laughs> you got some moves. I'll give you that. Hold on a minute. Don't I note you from somewhere? I don't know. Maybe. Garcia. Javier Garcia. For what is worth, I think you got screwed on the gambling thing. A lifetime ban. Shit. Should have had a 20 year career. The way I see it, nothing wrong with betting on yourself to win. <laughs> and that got a lifetime ban? Nah, uh, they just wanted to set an example. I was the poor bastard they used to do it on. All I know is what I read in the papers. Anyway, I'm Conrad. This here's Francine. He runs the place? I just take his money. <laughs> yeah, well, maybe I'm just letting you win. Oh, actually, if you're the gambling type, game's poker. Five card stud. I'll raise you. What do you think? Should I call or should I fold? Hmm, don't get too intimidated. I lose more often than I care to admit. He's bluffing. He's got bullshit written all over him. <laughs> Is that a fact? Yes. I think I'll listen to the man. Call. Moment of truth. Flip him. Oh my. Ain't that a pretty sight. Good looking hand there. But not good looking enough. God damn it. Shit, sorry. And thanks for playing. Let me get you a drink for the assist. On the house. Bottom up. Oh, man, this smells like turpentine. <laughs> That's the weak stuff. Don't turn away from me. I'm talking to you. Oh, shit. Hey, what's the point in talking when I already told you a deal is a deal, and it's done? What's going on? This guy ripped me off. I traded him a crate of perfectly good batteries, and he gave me a box of bullets that won't fire. He could have gotten both of us killed. Oh, yeah? And who the fuck are you, a bodyguard or something? Because I don't scare easy, all right? And I don't respond to threats, neither. Just make it right. We can all walk away from this nice and easy. Uh, well, you can't even prove those are the bullets I traded you. Oh, hey, Clem, come on. He knows the bullets don't work. Listen to him. He's not even nervous. I could have died because of his bullets. Unfucking believable. Look out! Hey, piece of gunk. Let's all cool down, huh? Shit. You were acting crazy. I was too. We just got a little out of hand. Oh, screw you. Just give me what I'm owed. Jesus. You've got to get her under control, man. 
Excuse me? This ain't no way to do business. How about fuck you? How's that for Alright, hey, okay, alright, so, hey, we'll, we'll trade back. I'll find some batteries. I don't need batteries. What I need are bullets that won't get me killed. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Drop the gun! Right now! See, he attacked you and that he was going for his gun. I fucking warned you! Eli attacked him. I only shot because... Shut it! You've done enough talking. Drop it. There's a herd out there, and you're firing off a fucking... What the fuck happened here? He attacked Javi, okay? It was self-defense. Enough from you. Did she really have to shoot? Look at my eye, man. Of course she's telling the truth. The guy ripped her off, reached for his gun, and would have shot me if she hadn't stopped him. See? You happy now? <sighs> God damn it. I'm putting you two under lock and key until I figure out what to do with Whoa. you. Whoa! Okay, what? Wow, what a dick move! Real? As real as it gets. Now move it. Oh, screw you. I'm so coming in and fucking up my bar. I oughta punch your fucking lights out. Both of ya. But Eli was a grade A certified dipshit. I'll even have someone come take a look at that cut. Hey, thanks for having my back at the hangar. That was, um, that was cool of you. I wasn't sure there for a minute. Of course. Anytime. Well, I mean, you and I are a team now. Thanks. I mean it. Just don't think this makes us friends or anything. Hello? I'm Eleanor. I'm what passes for a doctor around here. Trip sort of overdoes it sometimes. I hate that I'm treating you in a cage, like you're some feral animal. Javier. Pleasure's all mine. Is it now? Now, let's see about that wound. Yeah, he got you good. Try to hold still. Why is it always the pretty ones who end up causing the most trouble? As if good looks equal bad behavior or something. Yeah. Well, it takes one to know one. One what? One pretty troublemaker. <laughs> I'll give you that one. People are saying she killed a man in cold blood. If you don't mind me asking, what did happen exactly? That they were arguing and that she went crazy over nothing? Look, things got out of hand. Clementine was only trying to make a point, but then... You make it sound so casual. The best thing is probably for you two to leave town and get back to your group. We were attacked earlier this evening. There were four of us. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. If there's... If there's anything I can do to help. Well, not that I have much to offer you, but... I know a thing or two about losing family. If you really want to help me, let us out of this cage. Eleanor? You done yet? Just about. All right, here's what we're gonna do. I'm driving you that junkyard myself. Get you out of my hair, and no one can say I didn't do right by no one. In the meantime, you two can sleep right here and think about what shitheads you were earlier. On my terms and on my timeline. You got me? Nah, no way. I need to get back on the road ASAP. Javier, I'm not negotiating here. Trip, it doesn't seem right to wait. Javi's people, they can need a medic. No, nah, no way. Not putting you in that kind of danger again. That's not your call. Look, maybe there's another way. We've got a rear gate down at the other end of the airfield. We don't use it much, but... Well... We could leave tonight. Slip past the herd, get a jump start on reaching that junkyard. What? Seriously? 
and you do that for me. It's just... it's the right thing to do. Anyway, think about it. I've got to check on some patients, but I'll be back in an hour. You know, I never would have guessed she had it in her. Yeah, she's... she's something. The thing is, is, and maybe this sounds weird, but I still trust Trip more than I trust her. We're leaving tonight, with Eleanor. If it gets us there even a minute sooner, it's worth it. All right, I'm in. You know, when I met you, I thought you'd just be another asshole like everyone else. And to think that when we first met, you nearly blew my head off. <laughs> yeah, guess I made the right call. It sounds like Eleanor will be a little while. Maybe we should get a few winks. Good idea. I'm exhausted. I'll get the lamp. And this is where my can this is where my choice comes into play. Well, but then again, it doesn't really matter, and you guys are about to see why in a few minutes. But this was my this is the choice I made during my original playthrough hey, through season two fall? back when Can I was I playing it. Because no, I heard the other choices. Game, but I'll try to guess what it is. Just give me a second. I'll figure it out. Is it me? It is me. I knew it. Come on. Can you say Clem, AJ? Give it a try. Clem. Not much of a talker, are you, goofball? Edith says you should be speaking by now, but... Don't worry about it. You'll talk when you're ready. That was weird. Clem, open up. It's me. Edith, what's wrong? The group from last week. They're back. And now they're armed. This is bad, Clem. Th there's a lot of them. Too many of them. I, I don't like the looks of it. D do you need my help? No, I, I need you to pack whatever you can. Be ready to run just in case. They got a lot of cars and they're seriously pissed off. This is gonna get ugly. I know it. Speaking of Wellington, Pack we never stuff. got to see much. When I get back, we gotta get the hell out. Shit, shit, shit. We didn't see much of that community either. Which, in my opinion, that's kind of bullshit, but it's whatever. We fucking begged you, man. Our people are sick and starving. It didn't have to be this way. You could have just given us some grub, some medicine. That's it. This is your fault. Y'all are just hoarding it for your fucking self. Clem! Clem! Yikes. They're inside! <laughs> we have to go now! Just head for, for the woods. Keep running. That flashback would have been way more sadder if they expanded upon it, but it's whatever in my opinion. I don't know, it's whatever. They didn't expand more on that. Sun's up. At least in my opinion, anyway. Bad as hell by now. What do you think he'll do to you? Oh, nothing. He'll yell at me a little. Trip and I, we sort of used to be a thing. It was for like five minutes, and I fizzled out fast. But he never really got over it. Not that he's weird about it or anything. I just know he likes having me around. I gotta say, I think you could do a lot better than that, meathead. <laughs> you know what I mean. Guys, that's the place. It would be nice yeah, if Telltale, the old oh, Telltale, didn't cut out a lot from 
a new frontier because there was some co content that I think was pretty interesting. Guns out, yeah. If you insist. Jesus, must have been hundreds of them. Kate's good in a crisis. She'd know how to get shelter. What's that? I do not recall turning on my Xbox. Mm. My bad guys, have you heard that in the background? <laughs> Mariana's tape player. Mariana? Mariana, are you here? Javi! Oh my god! You're safe! I can't believe it! You told me where to hide. I just listened to what you said. Lock yourself in and don't come out, not even once it's quiet. It kept running through my head like on a loop. I don't even know how long I was in there. You did exactly what you should have done. I always knew you were a smart kid. Thanks. It was scary at first, but once the muertos couldn't see me anymore, they just passed by. Kate, and your brother, where are they? We got pulled apart when that huge bunch of muertos showed up. Kate yelled that they were gonna try to make it back to the van. And that's where we're headed. Let's go get your brother back, sweetie. Oh no. No. No sign of them. They must have seen it like this, then gone someplace else to hide. Kate. Mariana, stay back. Wait! Nobody shoots. He's right. We fire at the truck, we might hit them. I just said hit, hit her gun, hit the lock with her gun, and then boom, the lock just dies like that. That's pretty stupid. But whatever. Javi, you found us. Hey, hey, it's okay. I got you. You happy to see me? Gross. Come on. I think we get a pass. I, I wanted to come after you. I, I swear I did. You don't have to snot all over my shirt about it. I thought we were dead. Like, never gonna see you again dead. We only had a couple bullets left. I know it must have been awful, but it's all over now. Yeah, I, I know, but I was just so scared. I'm here now. You don't have to be scared. Hey, you hurt yourself. You must have scraped it in the truck. Didn't even notice. Hey, at least it's not a bite. Eleanor, think you can take a look? It's okay. I'm a doctor. I'll clean it here, then patch you up back home. See? Better already. We should be getting back. Don't want to push her luck. Who's the kid with the gun? She have a name you want to share with us? Clementine's a friend. Hi there. Glad I was able to help. Well, we're very grateful to you. Really. There's a town nearby. It's safe. I like the sound of that. Oh my god. Javi, do they have hot water? water? Even, Even like, like lukewarm water would be okay. Oh, and bubble bath. Wouldn't bubble bath be amazing? I think so. Right, Eleanor? <laughs> of course we have hot water. We're not cavemen. I thought you'd been to this place. I have. I just... I didn't have much time to relax in my jacuzzi suite. You know? <laughs> you look happy. I am. Search and rescue missions don't usually end so well. 
Alive and healthy. Sort of incredible. Guess I'm a lucky guy. The luckiest. When we get back to Prescott, you still owe me a working ride. I haven't forgotten about our deal. You couldn't have known what happened to your van, but still, I need some way out of here. Don't worry. I haven't forgotten our arrangement. I know it's not the easiest thing to find, but... Cool. Thanks. Child killer! Javi! We can't leave her! The bald child oh, killer! Shit! Oh. Kate! <coughs> Stop! Uh. Stop! Javi, <laughs> help! The fuck this? I'm gonna shoot this guy. Oh God, I can't believe it. Another character that deserves just... better. I know, Javi, and there will be time for all of that, but not right now. I need to get Kate back to Prescott so I can help her, which means we have to go. We have a window here, Javi. We have to move before they start shooting again. I can't leave her like this. I won't. That's not gonna bring her back, Javi. Now get up. We can't wait anymore. We stay here and we finish this. Are you crazy? We have to go now. I already killed one of you. If we don't stop them, they're gonna come after your family again. Let Eleanor help them. You stay with me. What? No, uh, Javi, you have to come with us. Javi, please! Trust me, Javi. We have to end this now. No, Javi, please come with us. Pl Get her back to Prescott. We'll cover you. Javi! Go with them. I'll be fine. I need your help, Gabe. Just keep firing until they're out of sight, okay? I'm ready. This would have been great if there was an actual shootout during this scene. I would have been like, let's go. But instead, we get this. They throw a bomb. Javi, don't! And now we gotta grab it and do this. <sighs> Would've been better if it was to shoot, like, you know, a shootout first, but I mean, it's whatever. I guess it is what it is. And unfortunately, the internet is down, and so I can't see my choices. And as you can see, even if I refre refresh, it this pops up. So, yeah, that's uh, episode one, Ties That Bend. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to end this stream here, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. And, uh, yeah, until then, have a fantastic rest of your day. Stay safe, and as always, peace out.